Hi guys, welcome back to Run Pet Bath and Beauty. Now, I have a whole bowl of my body wash, and I've already done some of them, bottled them. I actually made a mistake on which one to put activated charcoal in. I wanted to put activated charcoal in telekinesis, but, or uh, in, um, no, not telekinesis, what was it? Oh, in Notorious, and put Evergreen in Telekinesis, and I switched them. So I guess that's, you know, the way it's <laughs> going to be for now. But I did um, the Intuition, which is Telekinesis. I did the Sweet Child of Mine, which is Camu Camu. And I used, um, what did I use? The Tropical Sea Green. I used Rose Kaelin Clay in the, what was it, Heartbreaker, it, which is Bombshell, and I used the Evergreen, and I know this looks black, but when you see it, like, up close, it doesn't, it's not, and I used that for the Intuition, for the Telekinesis. So, each of these bottles holds, like, up to the Rhenish, um 18.25 ounces. I still have two to do. I have smoking in the boys room, which I'm going to color sterling silver. And I have Ed Hardy for women, which I'm going to color in my dark, uh, my dark shimmer gold. So I'm only going to do, um, one bottle. I want this to be a really short video for you guys. Plus this thing is really hard for me to get sure while we're doing this so yeah that's what we're gonna do and I'm just gonna continue to like go down the line and make more with this and be done I did put my preservative in here um, this definitely needs a preservative I do it at 1% so this has got a very large aloe vera content so let's do our 18.25 ish ounces it's not always easy to to get to that point I know my elbow is gonna be in y'all's way but I'm gonna try to get this as close to the 18.25 ounces okay well that's eight 18.65 close enough and this is a sterile process y'all so I have had everything all bleached alcohol and all of that this batch I tried to do, I tried to, um, what's it called? Uh, I tried to do at a one to one ratio and I kept having to add aloe to it. So I'm definitely going to keep the one to 1.5 ratio. So, okay. I can't really move this out of my way. I'm going to do the smoke in it. Well, I don't know, the Ed Hardy for women will be prettier. Let me move you guys in closer so you don't have that like bowl in your way. Okay. And if I have to move you up for the other one, all oh, my spoons are over here. And I'm not coloring it heavily. Woo! Okay, well, maybe that one's colored a little heavily. <laughs> And I wiped, uh, when I was alcoholing, one of my, um, ah, one of my bottles. Oh, I forgot to take the thing off of this, and I don't know if I'm going to be able to do it with gloves on. Oh, crap. Oh, there, it came off. Well, you know. And I've been using, in this 18.25 ounces, about six milliliters of fragrance. I'm going to just have to set this there and hopefully it doesn't fall over because that's eight ounces. And been mixing this all in there. If all of my mica does not uh, mix in there real well, once it gets into the bottle, I shake the crap out of it and then all of my mica is mixed in so 
And I do have funnels that have been also sterilized. And it's really simple, y'all. I mean, granted, I should be using bigger bowls to, um, to uh, something. Let me grab my funnel. I should be using, oh dang, guess what? My big butt just knocked stuff over. I bet you heard that, didn't you? Sorry about that quick edit. My butt hit some stuff that was uh, on my on my uh, coconut oil bucket and it crashed to the floor. So I fill the funnel up all the way and then I just let it go down. I have been moving the bottles to the side and moving on to my next fragrance. It makes it easier that way I have two funnels so that way I can oh it helps that the scale is on so that way I don't have to worry about it Woo! let's not have problems Sue Lynn I do I spill this all over the place you guys I guess I am going to do both of them. It's not a big deal. So, move this back over here and get my gray mica. My other spoon. My husband gets to try it for the first time tonight. I've been using it for weeks because I have, you know, the first batch, but I didn't put, um, what's it called, preservative in that. Oh, I love smoking in the boys' room. My daughter insisted on doing this one. I need one more mill. We have a customer that's doing a special order for smoking in the boys' room candles. I'm going to make three nine-ounce candles. Hold on, let me fill this strainer up again. And then we're going to stir this bad boy up. I'll have to grab my other strainer, and I may need more gray. Oh, no, this is perfect. This gray mica. Oh, that is perfect. I'm very happy that this actually turned out with my second recipe. <laughs> All I had to do was change some oils around, which was nice. I, and it's kind of funny because this is so very similar to my, I wipe all this alcohol off, so very similar to my, can you guys see that? Let's bring you up. There you go. My lotion recipe. My lotion recipe, I was uh, very fixed on doing it uh, sunflower and shea recipe for the most part. Although that doesn't have coconut oil. You know, uh, body wash needs to have a coconut oil in it to cleanse. That's what coconut oil does, is it cleanses. Fantastic! Okay. And the best thing about these cups, doing it this way, is they wash themselves. <laughs> they do. I just have to remember now with me, go, with me going around. Actually, I think I'm going to do the more popular, oop, the more popular scents. Um, start over with those because like my intuition, my tel that telekinesis is selling like, whew, hot cakes. As a matter of fact, I have to, uh, oh, I need that really quick. Woo! 
That's pretty full. Yeah, because there was like 1865 in there and not 1825. So these are pretty full. And then I just cap them, grab my caps, and re alcohol because I'm going to re alcohol my caps too. There we go. Got both sides. And then I'm going to label them. Easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. Yeah, so that's how I'm doing them. I am going to bring these to my last three shows of the year and see how they sell. And then we'll uh, determine if we're going to do some more of our other popular fragrances. We will definitely be taking special orders on these. Um, so these are the two that I had. Let me put them this way. Can you see the colors? I don't know if you can see the colors. Yeah, you can. And then I have the red, the rose clay, and the green. So six, three men's, three women's, and we're good. So I will see you guys next Friday. And uh, yeah, have a good night. Bye.